All right, so after quite a bit of time searching the caves under Jerry's tree, get out of here, zombie. Wasn't able to find any Realmites, Arlemite, Rupees, any of the above, so I abandoned that location, and now we're back in another familiar spot. We're in the ravine that uh, was part of our first little mining outpost back in the uh, early season one. So hopefully this will be more promising. I can't remember which Y value I, uh, I ended the copy-paste at, but I think there should actually be some diamonds like right around here, if I remember correctly. Um, actually, I think they were buried somewhere right around here because I entered just at the same location that I used um, when I first entered here way back when. Uh, so let's see. Oh, actually not covered this time. There we go. Some more diamonds. I already know exactly where they're going to be. Unfortunately, diamonds aren't exactly what we're looking for. Never get used to saying that, but we may as well take them anyway, because while we don't have any uh, super fancy divine RPG ores, well, it's as good as uh, we're going to get. So, anyway, I figure we're going to scour this area um, along the way in to get to this main ravine area. Didn't find anything, but that's probably because our elevation was too high, so I'm hoping. I mean, if you remember from uh, from the first season, this place has a lot of offshoots, so I'm, I'm hoping that we'll be able to find some Realmites, uh, I don't know, in a decently reasonable amount of time. So I figure, what, what elevation are we at here? We're at Y equals 14, which seems pretty good. Uh, I think, let's use our bucket, and uh, we'll actually scour this lava flow. And uh, maybe we'll be able to find some stuff. Although I do kind of want to use the lava for lights. I did go back and make some more torches as well, so uh, pretty stocked up there. Okay, so we shall continue along the lava flow and see if we can't find some good stuff. All right, and uh, actually, I think once again, if I remember, cr hello there, uh, if. <laughs> <laughs> Good day to you, sir. <laughs> hope you enjoyed your fall. Uh, I hope you enjoyed your trip. Have a nice fall into lava. Goodbye. You too. And you three. I know you're not going to give me any gold if I do that to you, but it's worth seeing it. Man, I'm so sorry I had to do that to you, zombie. But uh, you left me no alternative. Let's keep going along here. Maybe there will be something in here. Just gonna put a torch down because once I waste all the lava, turn it into obsidian, uh, might get kind of dark. All right, nothing in here. Hmm. Did get kind of dark back here though. So. Oh, snaps! I was trying to put a torch down and looky what we have here. Oh man. Awesome. Woo! Dude. That was pretty quick. Okay. So this is Realmite. Notice how it's kind of, it's like coppery kind of color. It's closest to the iron color, but it's kind of embossed. So, uh, interesting that uh, he was able to emboss it in still a 16 by 16 texture. But anyway, there we go. I'm hoping that when I mine it with the diamond pickaxe, it doesn't just, I hope I don't, I don't, I, I, okay, let's just go for it. Oh, it gave it to me. Oh my God. Look at that, it's Realmite ore! <gasps> oh my goodness, it's amazing! Oh crap, we have like a nice vein going here, don't we? I swear, if there's any lava under you... Okay, good, there's not. Okay, nice, nice, keep it coming! Keep it coming, even more! Dude, there's no lava under you, is there? Nope, good, good, just gotta make sure. Alright, dude, that was six! Six all at once! Sweet! Okay, um, uh, I don't know if this is exactly- Oh, god dang it. Get out of here. <laughs> um, I think, uh, I'm just gonna go this way because I think I might remember where I am, and if I do, I think there are some diamonds close by. Um, ow, god darn it. Hello, okay, I think there's a zombie spawner really nearby as well. So, I'm gonna have to try to find that. Hello, gold! Hello, hello! Here we go. Kill you for some more go- Oh, and I got a- I got a, What did I get? I just got a potato. That's the first time I've ever gotten that with uh, the 1.4 drop. Huh. Alright. Anyway. 
Let us, yeah, I think there are some diamonds in here if I remember correctly because this room looks very, very familiar. Oh, and I might get a shovel when I kill you. Some, some free tools. You just dropped gold before I killed you. That's really interesting. Can I get a shovel? Nope, you're not going to be generous. Whatever, dude, whatever. Um, is it right? Yep, there are some diamonds. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, glad I have uh, at least a decent memory of that. Uh, let's open up another space here. Okay. Oh, and I should eat some food, too. Locking out so far, I think. All right. So, here we go with our more diamonds and more diamonds. Uh, yeah. It's pretty sweet. Pretty, pretty sweet, if I do say so myself. Uh, no, don't. Holy crap, that was freaking close. Okay. That's all the diamonds for right here, I think. So, my damage, we continue on up, y'all. And uh, try to find that zombie spawner dungeon. It was, uh, I think it was back here somewhere? Not sure. Seems like that's where most of the uh, zombies were. Yeah, no, we were just here, so I don't think it's right here. Maybe back up. A little bit. I don't know. Oh, maybe it's up here. Let's us check it out. Hello! There we go. There's a zombie dungeon. Just another way for us to collect some more gold. It's really interesting how they actually spawn testificate zombies. I wonder if... Ow! Um, I don't think that these regular zombie spawners can spawn zombies that have items equipped, but I might be mistaken. Um... I don't know. I don't know. Give me more gold. I have a good reason to kill all of you. Ooh, look at this. More buckets. And more. Ouch. Alright. And more gold. Uh, shall I mine the mossy cobble? I will do that so that I can. Sorry, bad. I don't want to hurt you, man. You got to get out of the way. <laughs> um, yeah, so I can sell this at the blacksmith for lots of money. Ouch. Want swimming pools of money. Don't you shoot, Scrooge McDuck. Don't you dare. I have so much money I could pay people to kill you. So much gold. So much gold. Okay, there we go. Oh, he just dropped some iron. All right. Finally getting to uh, take advantage of some of these special uh, special mob drops. Awesome. All right. All right, Bat. Come on, dude. Why are you hanging around in such a dangerous area? I don't want to hit you with my pickaxe. Stop it. God darn it. Ouch. Son of a gun. It's weird how sometimes they drop gold before you actually kill them. I don't know if that's uh, supposed to happen or if it's a bug. Either way, it's a bug that works in my favor. So I'm not going to complain. Uh, let's keep getting this stuff. Blacksmith, I'm going to allow you to create such a magical piece of mossy cobble. You're gonna pay me so much money. Ugh. Yeah. Here we go. All right. I could I could totally use my diamond pickaxe because I have so many diamonds now. It's just like, good god. Okay. I wonder how far I've actually progressed as far as my uh, path to kingship. I've been told. I have been told. And I don't know if this is true or not, but that when I get halfway to being king, the evil dudes will try to, like, attack the kingdom. And I don't know if that means they will tromp on through straight line, sh shortest path to try to get to the kingdom from where they are, which would mean fire in my jungle. Uh, <laughs> let's hope not. But, uh, or if, if our people just will go to war with them. I really don't know. Either way, I'm hoping that uh, we don't burn down the jungle. Yeah. That's oh snaps! Oh some more realmites! Oh man, dude. Check it out! Uh, I'm gonna use diamond pickaxe just to be safe, because I don't know if using an iron pickaxe will not allow me to pick it. Oh, you're just gonna give me one. Or are you di a diagonal the attack no, just one. Wow, dude. Lucky number seven. Maybe there will be some more over here. Okay, come on. Uh I I don't know how many Realmite ores or Realmite ingots one Realmite ore will give you. You have to smelt it, as far as I'm aware. 
Um, and then I, I hope it gives you more than one. I really do, because that's a lot of work just to get a few. Uh, well, we'll keep exploring and hope I don't get myself lost. But uh, we are so far on a path to finding Zeralmites. Although uh, Arlomite and Rupees still evade us, don't they? And uh, they may continue to do so. In fact, I wouldn't be too surprised because according to helpful comments, Arlomite is supposed to be more common than diamonds, which so far doesn't seem to be the case. Um, and Arlomite is supposed to be a little bit rarer than diamonds, and Rupees are supposed to be unfathomably rare. So that's great. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know how much luck we're gonna have on that, but uh, we'll see. I hope I hope I don't have to make any like special exceptions in order to create the uh, mysterious clock because I have to. Uh, I don't think I explained this yet. So I spawn the uh, the first boss with the mysterious clock, or forget what spawns the watcher, but the mysterious clock spawns the yellow four-legged thing. I'm gonna do guy, dude. Um, <laughs> yeah, that guy. I know you all know who I'm talking about. Uh, <laughs> And when I kill those bosses, they will ouch, drop what is needed in order to, uh, they drop divine shards, and those can be crafted into divine rock, which is needed to get to Dravite Hills. Whew, Dravite Hill portal thing made of divine rocks. I think I just explained it properly. You can correct me if I'm wrong. But anywho, that's why we need all this stuff, is because we need to make the mysterious clock. So, now you know. Um, I guess I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back to the ravine just so I can get my bearings as to uh, where I am and After that I will sort of just scour the ravine and see if I can find any stuff. Hello there creeper Get out of here. Well, that's effective I guess but I don't get any gold from you doing that so uh, at least I get double the gold from this zombie He's feeling generous unlike you guys who are just feeling like uh, blowing up and I give me anything I don't think that there is any any stuff in this area. It's it's like this cave system is just so vast that um, I, I I don't want to get lost. Is basically what it boils down to. So um, what I may do is just I don't know get myself lost and then take advantage of a command block. So I have no idea. No idea. I may actually check to see if the teleporter mod has been fixed as well. So uh, that could be another viable option. All right. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Okay, let's uh, keep exploring the... Oh, is that a slime? <gasps> it's a slime! Oh my gosh, and a creeper almost tried to blow... Where are the... Oh, where are you? Oh my god, it's two slimes. Oh god, I'm try not trying to hit you, slime. I'm so sorry. Jerry's cousin is gonna get angry. Oh god, there's so many. Holy god! There's- Oh shoot! Give me out of the lava! Oh god! Oh god! Oh, don't- don't let me die. Don't let me die. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh, this is not good! Not good! Oh no, I died! With- with my- Oh dear, this is gonna be a- a mission. We're going on a freaking mission. We have to get back before I die. Holy crap! I don't need two leggings, a helmet, chest plate, uh, and shoes, and this are actually my diamond sword. All right, we're on a we're on a mission right now. Oh God, we gotta go quickly. Gotta go quickly. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Dear God, I was just freaking assaulted. Police officer, uh, I'd like to file a police report against a gang of bad guys who decided that. Uh, they weren't going to abide by the rules, and they were going to take me out in a very unpleasant fashion. All right, um, shoot, I should have brought food. <laughs> that was an awful idea. Uh, hold on. God damn it, I can't let my stuff to spawn. Um, give me food. Give me food. Okay. And back down the tree we go. Oh, okay, gotta go fast, gotta go fast, gotta go fast. I'm just gonna get my stuff back. 